this is the first video in the series on how to defeat more advanced players. And the first um, tactic or secret or strategy is to prevent them from developing their single corner. Old Faithful is the most popular opening for white because they're trying to develop their single corner. And your immediate response would be to exchange. Mm. So that you can develop your single corner as well. And as long as it's safe to do so, you continue developing your single corner. Now, if he moves his checker there, your immediate move would be place your checker there on the extreme right hand side. Now, by placing this checker here, you obviously prevent him from developing the single, his single corner anymore. Because he can't move there, he can't move there. If he moves there, he creates an elbow. If he moves there, he creates an elbow. So your next best move is to move your checker there to prevent him from taking a double checker. So let's see what he does now. Okay, so he's decided exchange. So he's got rid of the elbow at the moment. So what I'm going to do is to squeeze this checker here by moving it, my checker here. And that will make him move one of his checker from the second back row. Or he could move his checker here, but then he puts it in danger of it being a hanging checker. So he's probably not going to do that. So he's just going to exchange. All right. Okay, so I still have my um, three back checkers in, in place, so I'm in no danger. So I'm going to move my checker here to get to my sweet spot here. See if I can place a checker on my sweet spot. Okay, if he moves there, you, you can um, get a double and um, pull one of his another back checker away from his back row. Let's see what he's going to do. He can't move this checker here because uh, he will lose it. Okay, so that's what he's going to do. All right, so. Okay, my next best move is not to try to squeeze this checker again. And let's see what it does. He can't move it here because I can. Um, it's going to be a hanging checker, and he, he will lose it if it moves there. So let's see what he does. Well, that's that's a bad move for him because he um, actually moved another checker out from his back row. Um, and he, he's more or less forced to do that because I'm preventing him from moving um, these checkers here. So I'm going to squeeze this checker here and see what he does. Okay, so he's exchanged. And now he's going to obviously try to um, pin two of my checkers with this checker. So I'm going to move here and let's see what he does. Okay, he's thinking. And this is the importance of uh, preventing from getting developing a single corner because these two checkers here are stuck. Oh, well, he's made a mistake. Do you see the mistake? And I'm... Um, see if you discover it. So, obviously, I know I've won the game.
because he's made a mistake. So it involves pitching a checker and then pitching two checkers and getting a double and you get a king. So that's how you do it. You pitch that checker and then you pitch another one and you get a double. You, you get your checkers back. Okay, and now I still have my two anchor checkers. So now <laughs> the game is almost lost for him now because um, this checker is hanging there. I'm just going to use my um, king to come after this checker and I still have my two anchor checkers. So it's impossible for him to get a king. So I'm going to use my king to try to uh, take this checker here. Okay. So to prevent it from developing um, this checker here, I will uh, move this checker here. Let's see what it does. So we exchange. And then I'm going to bring my king now to attack this hanging checker here. And he can't break up my two anchor checkers because I've got a king to prevent him from um, forming a line to break up these two anchor checkers. We have five checkers each, but I've got a better position. And that's very important. Okay, so I'm going to play there. Okay, now his moves are getting very limited because he can't move this checker, it's frozen, he can't move this checker here. All the checkers are faced off, so my best move right now is to move this checker so I can try to face off this checker as well now. Okay, so all the checkers are faced off so I can don't get another king. And if he moves this checker here, I will get a double shot. So he's lost. He's run out of moves because all the checkers are faced off. Okay, double checker. It's just a matter of um, himself destructing now. <laughs> now I have five against three. He stands no chance of winning. I think he's going to probably give up. Why well, is he not moving? He's got 16 more seconds, 40 more seconds to make a move. Five, four, three, two, one, game over. Okay, and that's how you win by preventing him from developing the single corner. Please click the like notification and subscribe button for the next video in this series. Have a great day.